Hey guys, it's Vicki. Welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to use Google Trends and doing so will definitely help you source better for your Poshmark closet. It'll actually help you understand um, what people are searching for on Google when they're searching for it, the time, um, the times they're searching for it, what brands, what style names, all of that kind of stuff is here. So I'm going to show you what to do. If you're already familiar with Google Trends, that's awesome. Um, I love this. I love Google Trends. It is my favorite thing in the world. Um, well, I can't say it's the favorite thing in the world, but it's one of my favorite things. So, all right, so we're going to get into this. The first thing that I want to let you know is to get to Google Trends, you will go to googletrends.com. And from there, you will be here on this page. And what you'll do is you, you want to enter a search term or a topic. So just the FYI, Google Trends is, it basically holds on to everything that people are typing in the Google search bar. And I want to show you, I went ahead and I typed pink cabbie blouse in Google just to show you that, yes, our Poshmark listings do show up in the Google search. So I've seen a lot of uh, titles that will say just like pink shirt or pink blouse or pink dress. That's like a big no-no because if you type that in, let's just take the cabbie out. And then it's going to just show up everything else, you see. Um, I don't even see anything for Poshmark at all. So we know right away um, when you add that um, brand name, immediately. Poshmark is like the first thing that pops up. Isn't that amazing? I mean, it even pops up before Cabby's actual website. So that's pretty amazing. So just make sure that you have the brand name listed in your title. Definitely have the brand name, even the style name, the color, all of that. It's going to help people find you. So anyway, enough of that. So we'll get out of that part. We'll go back to Google Trends. All right. So here on Google Trends, I want to go through and I want to look at certain types of clothing to see what is being searched the most. Um, I'm going to first do a year search, I guess, a search from the last year to see when things were being searched the most online. So the first thing I'm going to type in will be jackets. Or should I just do jacket? I'm just going to do jacket. All right. So as you can see, it goes back an entire year. And you can search up here by you know, hour, hours, day, um, all of these right here, you know, it's very helpful. Um, you can even go through categories to kind of narrow it down a little bit. In fact, let me see, I can probably do some categories that might help us a little bit more. So we'll do shopping and we'll do apparel. Um, we'll just stick with apparel. All right, so the word jacket has been searched the most right here in the month of November. So you know that's when more people are looking for jackets. They are looking for it in the month of November the most. Now, obviously, it, you know, it starts going down from November and then it dwindles down. People are still looking for it, but the most people were searching in November. So, um, obviously in the summertime, you know, people still buy these things. So don't stop buying them just because, um, you know, it's not a peak season for it. Definitely if you run across a, a good bolo item, grab it, you know. Um, but anyway, so down here it'll show like the interest by subregion. So it'll show like um, New York had 100 search interest, um, District of Columbia, so on and so on. And then... <laughs> These are the rising queries, or the, yeah. All right, so these are the rising queries. These are things that people have been searching for. Um, North Face jacket for women is going up. Moncler jacket for women. Sherpe jacket women. Melania's jacket. So apparently Melania must have had some type of jacket people are wanting. Um, you can also go to top. And it'll show you that more people search for the, the word men's jacket 
leather jacket, black jacket, north face jacket, denim jacket. So right there kind of shows you, okay, those are some of the things that you need to be looking for. So, you know, a black leather men's jacket would probably do pretty well for you. Um, let's just click on men's jacket here and see what it shows us. All right, so as with the other, November, that's the peak time for jackets. Um, all right, so related queries for men's jacket. We have North Face winter coats, men's Ariat jacket, men's Nautica jacket, North Face rain jacket, um, Eddie Bauer, which is shocking. I never pick up Eddie Bauer because I always thought it was kind of a cheap brand. Um, it used to be, I used to drive an Eddie Bauer Explorer, <laughs> but um, I always thought that, they kind of got bad out by like Kmart or something. I don't know. Sears. Okay. So as you can see, related topics. I can't tell you 100% what related topics are. So let's see. What does it say here? It helps you. So it says users searching for your term also search these topics. You can view the following metrics. So the word top means the most popular topics. And uh, rising is related topics with the biggest increase in search frequency since the last time period. So obviously this is for a 12 month period. This is not recent stuff. So I'm just kind of showing you over the last 12 months. So if we want to look at the last, I don't know, we'll say the last 30 days, um, there was a peak for men's jacket in March and it's gone down pretty much. There's a few peaks here and there, but um, it's, you know, pretty low. Men's spring jacket is a query that is being searched a lot right now. So that's interesting. Um, men's leather jacket, leather jacket, men's rain jacket, bomber jacket, men's suit jacket. So, you know, as you can see, this is kind of cool. You know, this is a cool thing to kind of help you see what people are searching for because since you can be found on Google, you know, it's a good thing um, because Poshmark apparently pops up pretty quickly for people. So that's awesome. All right. So right here we have related topics to these queries. So khaki color, obviously they're looking for khaki color spring jackets, um, men's jacket, khaki color, uh, Balenciaga. Yeah. Good luck on that one. <laughs> Nylon, um, aircraft pilot, Nordstrom rack. So let's type or let's click on men's leather jacket and just look at that. So in the past 30 days, people from Maine have had the top interest in men's leather jacket. Now that's another thing I want to bring up real quick about that. So you can also share your closet during peak times for people in these time zones. So say Maine is East Coast, so you would share your closet, you know, during a time where they're probably going to be on their phones, um, looking around, searching the internet, all that. Um, just a little FYI, that's what I do. <laughs> all right, um, so there's nothing here, because obviously there's nothing going on there. Um, Gucci lining Harley Davidson. Well, we all know if we run across a Harley Davidson leather jacket to pick it up, right? Because that's good money. Um, but yeah, so that's that. So let's go and look up something else. Um, I actually have a list of brands that people have given me, and I'm going to go back to 12 months. And I had my Instagram followers give me some brands that were considered bolo brands at one time, which just sit for them now. They don't really sell anymore. So I'm going to look those brands up. Surprise, surprise. Um, that's what this video was about pretty much looking up these things, seeing what's selling, what people look for, all that great stuff. So, um, okay. So the first brand that I was given was Prana. So this will help you if we're lucky, not always will it come up, but, um, this will help you see like what areas are looking for this brand, what, what areas are searching this brand the most, which will help you with your time zones. Um, it'll also show you what type of items for those brands that they're looking for the most. So Prana was the first item and immediately we have these breakouts. Um, the Brienne pant 
I don't really know what that is. The Permafrost Half Zip. Um, their jackets do really well still. Um, definitely, if you ever run across a Prana jacket or a coat or a pullover sweater, pick them up because they are good money. And I'm talking 80 to $150. They're good money. All right, so these are the rising um, queries, which if you don't know what a query is, it is what people are searching in the Google um, in the Google bar. So say Prana, you're searching Prana pants in the Google bar and press and search. That's what these are from. So these are things that people have looked for. All right, so now we can go to top, which these are the most popular searches. Prana pants, Prana yoga, Prana women's, Prana men's, REI Prana. So obviously Prana pants is a pretty good one. Um, there are certain types of pants that do better than others. Um, the skinny leg leggings, those do pretty well. Um, let's see. Let's look down here and just see what else they have. Okay. All right, so Prana pants. So keep in mind, if you're looking for Prana stuff to source, Prana pants. And when I say Prana pants, I don't mean the leggings. I'm talking about like the Prana pants, which are like kind of like the North Face pants, like the convertible pants they have. Prana has pants like that too. Um, they have, you know, obviously they have style names and stuff, but um, let's just click one and see if it has a style name. Might. All right, so um, right here it shows the style name. So the Prana Helena pants are, okay. The Prana Vaha pants, uh, Prana Climbing pants, REI Prana pants. So if that gives you an idea of what type of Prana pants that you want to be sourcing, that right there is them. Now I'm going to go back. All right, so on to the next brand. I have already typed in Cabby. Um, Cabby, the newer labels do okay. The older labels, which are the long skinny labels, they don't do too well. Um, my stuff that I get, I get a lot of that type, and it sits for a while, but that's like my thrift stores have it constantly. So, um, But the cabbie square tags, those are the newer cabbie, and they do pretty decent. Um, so let's go down here and just see what they've got. Um, so people are looking for, over the last year now, um, Cabby 2018, Cabby 2019, 2019 Spring, Cabby Clothing 2019, Cabby Clothing Line. Let's look at the top searches. Cabby Clothing. Hmm. Let's just see if there's anything here. Sometimes when you go deeper into the search, you don't really find a lot. Um, so it's looking like jeans. Now, I have seen where Cabby Jeans did pretty well. Let me see if I can find that again. Um, nope. Let's see. Let's do Cabby Clothing 2019 and see what that says. Nothing. All right, well, you can't always find exactly what you're looking for doing this. So Cabby Clothing is obviously, I don't know, let's see. Cabby jeans. We'll type that. This is where we'll do a little comparison. Um, cabby jeans, and then let's do cabby blouse and a cabby jacket and cabby pants. Woo, that's all over the place. So cabby jackets um, are searched for more. So that kind of tells you um, jackets would probably do a little bit better. Um, and obviously only people in California have been looking for the jackets. I wonder if that's just one person. <laughs> well, obviously not, but okay. So cabby jackets and then next would be blouses and then cabbie jeans and the lowest search is for their pants. So if you're trying to sell cabbie pants, eh, probably not a good idea because not a lot of people are looking for them. So obviously you would want to look up their jackets. So let's see. Oh man, nothing. So let's just type in or let's just click on the cabbie jacket search term and let's do that for Let's do the past five years and just see what it says. OK. 
Okay. That's too much information. Alright, so we're going to do it for the last 30 days. So yeah, it shows you that more people are looking for their jackets um, than anything else. Um, their jeans had a pretty good spike at the beginning of April. And their cabbie jeans. So it's looking like the jeans are doing pretty well right now. So that's interesting. Let's see if... I don't think they had... Yeah, there's no information down here, so that sucks. Um, we will go back out of this, and we will type in... Let's just type cabbie jeans and see if there's a certain type of jeans that people are searching for, if they give us that information. Sometimes you just don't get it, so... Yeah. I mean, it says boyfriend, so I'm assuming maybe boyfriend jeans. Um, as a related topic... There's no queries, unfortunately. It says your search doesn't have enough data to show here. So, yeah, that sucks. Um, let's type in cabbie jackets. Or cabbie jacket. Okay, so California. <laughs> and there's nothing here. So, yeah, cabbie just seems to not be doing well at all. That's unfortunate. All right, well, we will move on to the next item, and that would be Free People. Next brand is Free People. Free People is pretty hit or miss with me. Um, it really does depend. Oh, well, you know why it probably didn't have any information? Because I didn't have this. Okay, so let me go down to Shopping, and then Apparel. Okay. So... Interest has been pretty steady with a little jump in November. So, yeah, that's interesting. Um, District of Columbia has the most interest in free people. Alright, so these are some of the related rising queries. Uh, as you see, they're using the actual style names. The Found My Friend sweater, Softly Structured Tunic, Eleven sweater, Kiss Kiss Tunic. Free people color my world jumpsuit. So with free people, one thing that you can do to help increase your sales is to actually use the style name. And it might take a little bit of time to do some research, but definitely find that style name for your free people um, items, and that will probably increase some of your sales because people are using or typing that directly in. Um, so let's go to top searches. So the top query people are looking for, free people dress, free people sweater, free people Nordstrom, free people dresses, free people jackets. So let's just tie, let's click on this one, free people dress, and see if it gives us some information. All right, so obviously it peaked a little bit last year during this time. Look at there, it's kind of going up. It says down here, values for this point have partial and complete data available, which is unfortunate, and but it, it is what it is. Um, so we'll look at during this time. All right, so as you see, these are some of the top queries. That are, well, these are some of the most searched for qu queries right now. Uh, free people sunny day dress, free people Priscilla dress, the love you midi dress, Adela dress, French quarter wrap dress. So... Be on the lookout for those. Um, the top free people maxi dresses are one of the most looked for things, and free people black dresses. So definitely, if you run across free people maxi dress, those do well. I have never found a free people maxi dress. I only find the little short sundresses, and I cannot sell them to save my life. So yeah, um, maxi dresses, and then their black dresses. All right, so we will leave out of this one and. Let's go to the next Lucky Brand, another brand I, as hit or miss with me. Go down here to Apparel again. So I hope, if you've not used Google Trends, I'm hoping that by now you're understanding. I mean, it's really fun to sit down and just get a pen and paper, get your laptop, sit on the couch, turn on some YouTube to listen to in the background, and just, you know look up some stuff. 
Um, so the lucky brand Yava Wedge Booty seems to be doing, there's a lot of searches for that right now. Um, the lucky brand Hayden Skinny, which is probably skinny jeans. Now, obviously skinny jeans do very well. And something else over here, mule. Okay, yeah, it says animal, but you know what they're actually looking for. They're looking for lucky brand mules, um, the shoes. So lucky brand mules, if you run across those, pick them up. Um, uh, lucky brand Bridget Skinny, Lucky brand Lolita Skinny. So obviously Lucky brand Skinny Jeans are doing very well. They're wedge booty. This one, these might be like newer items, um, which the chance of finding them in thrift stores could be pretty slim to none, um, but you never know. Uh, let's go to top. Lucky brand jeans is the top thing people are searching for when it comes to Lucky brand. Let's click on Lucky brand jeans and just see it gives us some info. All right, so, um, huh, interesting. Not much. Just Lucky Brand Jeans Women, Buckle Jeans. So, yeah, it doesn't give you much information, but you immediately know you need to be looking for Lucky Brand Skinny Jeans, not boot cut jeans, none of that. Skinny jeans, those will sell for you. Um, in another video, I might actually compile this list of items to see what they're selling for on Poshmark. That might be kind of fun to do. All right, so let's go on to the next brand. And I was given seven for all mankind. Um, seven for all mankind. I guess I typed that right. I hope it's not two, one word. We'll see. Um, I might have typed it wrong. Is it mankind one word? That's better. <laughs> All right, so um, let me go down here again. All right, so we're looking up seven for all mankind, and the only thing that pops up is seven for all mankind women's jeans, um, because apparently that's all people look for. I don't think I've ever found anything else by them. Have I? No. So we will click that and see what it tells us. Oh, so let's go nothing. Nothing at all. Guys, nothing. Okay, so let's just type in seven for all mankind jeans. Let's see if that gives us any kind of information. <laughs> Men's jeans, so yeah, that one's not really going to give us much. Um, let's see if they have any top. All right. Um, Oh, you know what I just thought about? Some for all kind women's jeans. Let's try this again. All right. So we'll do apparel. Sorry. Okie doke. All right. So we will click on top and it doesn't really give us much information it just says seven for all mankind jeans seven for all mankind men's jeans seven for all mankind women's jeans so um those are just some queries people are putting in their search bars um which could possibly help you now let me spread this out and see i'm gonna do it different ways I'll try that and see nothing all right well let's do the little short what people always use on Poshmark. There we go. Oh, only people in Texas search for that, apparently. <laughs> so, yeah, Seven for All Mankind. Um, not really seeing much on that one, so that's sad. Uh, let's go on to the next one. We'll do Miss Me. And Apparel. All right, so... Um, that's definitely not what we're looking for. Let's just type in Miss Me Jeans. All right. So Miss Me Capri Jeans um, are rising right now. Miss Me Jeans, the buckle, Miss Me Bootcut Jeans. Um, let's do top. What's the top? Uh, Miss Me Jeans size, buckle, buckle jeans, Miss Me Skinny Jeans. 
So yeah, not a lot of information is being given on Miss Me Jeans. So that kind of tells you not a lot of people are looking for that anymore. So, you know, you can still pick them up, um, but it's just not... Right now, it looks like Capri Jeans are doing pretty well. So um, if you've run across any Miss Me Capri Jeans, then pick them up. Um, let's just see. Nope, not enough data. So yeah, um, just not a lot of people searching for Miss Me Jeans anymore. So that's why a lot of people's sales are not so hot. Um, all right, let's look up the next item or the next brand. I keep saying item. Um, Sam Edelman. That is one that I have their, their shoes. Like I'm having trouble selling shoes. Now it could just be because of the types of shoes that I'm selling. Um, I don't know. So let's look and see what, what's breaking out right now. Apparently their boots and booties seem to do well, though I have some booties that just aren't moving. Um, as you see, it has the style names by them. Let's look at top. So obviously, yes, yeah, Sam Edelman boots do the best. Sam Edelman sandals. I don't know. The boots don't seem to do well for me right now. Okay, so they do better in November and December. Well, obviously, they're not going to do well for me now because it's friggin' April. So, yeah, they're not doing too hot right now. But it does show you um, the types of boots. Studded boots do really well. So, all right. Um, let me go back to the sandals. Or no, I was looking at top. Okay, so I want to look up what type of shoes are doing well in the last 30 days for Sam Edelman. Is it Edelman or Edelman? I've never known. Okay, so obviously the mules are, you know, doing pretty good right now. The circus sandals are doing well also. Loafers... Circus by St. Edelman Sandals. And uh, FYI, this also can help you with your keywords um, for your titles also. Okay. So, hmm. Let's see what this one's going to show up. So, New York and Florida. Not much. All right. So, um... Sandals, not um, yellow, gold. Hmm. So these are just related topics that people are also searching whenever they're searching for Sam Edelman sandals. So they're looking for mules, they're looking for gold Sam Edelman shoes or sandals and yellow sandals. So keep that in mind. Let's look up the top sandal, high heeled shoe, circus, Nordstrom heel. So sandals are being searched the most right now. Okie dokie. So let's go back to our 12 month and the next item that we're going to look up is going to be uh, coach. Hmm. Coach. Um, I wonder if I should put coach bags. Mm. Let's just type in coach and see if we can find uh, maybe fashion accessories? Do they have that? Mm, I'm not seeing that. So, clothing accessories. Would that be considered a clothing accessory? There we go. Oh, wow. Well nothing. Um, maybe that is too narrow. There, we'll try it like that. So we'll look up coach. Okay. So a coach dreamer bag, coach trail bag, um, a coach L hobo, 
these are some that and obviously this has nothing to do with that these are some that are being searched for right now um, let's look up the top coach bag coach purse wallet coach coach leather coach purses so let's type in coach bag and see what we can find there so people in Hawaii are still looking for coach bags coach dreamer bag all right what else so yeah the hobo bags are they do pretty well the coach hobo bags even the vintage hobo bags do really well um, okay so coach dreamer bag trail bag if anything it's showing you how important it is to use the style names in your titles let's look up top all right so coach leather bag coach bag so we did that all right so I'm not going to go too far into it. I'm just kind of giving you an idea. Um, the next one is LuLaRoe. That is something that people really aren't buying anymore. Um, as you see, it started at the top and it just kind of dwindled down over the last year. Um, LuLaRoe Caroline. So let's see, what is Caroline? Um... All right, so looking up the LuLaRoe, it's a Caroline cardigan. So um, this is apparently something that people are still interested in, this cardigan right here. So if you find a LuLaRoe cardigan that kind of resembles the style, it's probably a good idea to pick it up. Um, these are all breakouts. Caroline seems to be a good one. Liv, Marley look at top LuLaRoe size so LuLaRoe leggings which leggings are people looking for I'm interested to know holiday leggings holiday leggings Christmas leggings tween leggings so yeah um, obviously you know the holiday stuff probably does a little bit better uh, look at the last 30 days because I highly doubt much is going on there yeah not much right so let's type LuLaRoe for the last 30 days um, the LuLaRoe Live Marley LuLaRoe LuLaRoe Azure LuLaRoe Marley so these two are doing well um, top let's see I'll click on that go a little deeper So it's obviously a shirt. I don't know all of those tops, the names of them, but so yeah. All right, so moving on. Um, the next brand was Lululemon. Some people were saying they were having trouble selling Lululemon. Now, obviously, you know, there's a lot of supply and not as much demand on Poshmark for Lululemon. I'll first go to the 30 day, I mean the 12 months. So the on the move pants are one to be on the lookout for. Let's look up their top. So Lululemon, their leggings not not doing too hot there. Huh. Alrighty. Well, let's kind of go through and see what kind of stuff they've got. So yeah, not a lot of searches are being done. So just their leggings. So obviously I don't see anything in here for tank tops or tops. It's all about leggings. People are wanting the leggings. So um, keep that in mind about Lululemon leggings. Um, those are going to be your top sellers. And also they peak in December, right before that New Year's, you know. All right, so the Lululemon Thermal Leggings do really, that's what people are looking for right now. Um, yeah. And if you're a blogger and you're looking for um, 
titles, topics. This is also a good way to do it. You could definitely make a blog about how to wash Lululemon Align leggings, if you know how, <laughs> and you'll get a good bit of traffic. All right. Um, Eileen Fisher. Let's try that one. Okay, so it's pretty steady all year long. Um, Eileen Fisher Ives Booty. Eileen Fisher Renew. Eileen Fisher Grant for Women. That's nothing to do with clothing. So shawls are a related topic. Fashion boots. So apparently they're looking for Eileen Fisher boots. Hmm. All right, so let's see the most popular. Um, Eileen, Eileen Fisher pants. Eileen Fisher dress. Um, yeah. So let's put in pants and see what we can find. Now, you see that? Not enough information right now. So, um, that peaks around May and June, apparently. Let's go down and see what they got. The Eileen Fisher crepe pants is something that people are looking for. So, um, over here we have the types of Eileen Fisher stuff people are looking for. Cardigan, sweater, sweatshirt, satin, blouse, trousers, um, slim fit pants. So I'm going to click that and see what it says. Nothing. Nothing, nothing. But yeah, so the crepe pants seem to do well. I don't even know what crepe pants are. When I hear crepe, I think of food. So anyway, so Eileen Fisher crepe pants seem to do well in the search world. Um, let's try one last uh, query, and we're going to do Cole Haan shoes. Well, let's just do Cole Haan and just see, because I've been trying to sell their shoes, and I, it, they just don't sell well for me. So um, Cole Haan. Here we go. So the Corin Chelsea boot does well, or did well. Um, Cole Haan Fendra sandal. Let's see if I can narrow this down a little bit. Um, shopping apparel. Alrighty, so... We will go to top and see. So people look for Kohan shoes more than anything. Um, boots, men's Kohan. I, I don't pick up men's Kohan. I should. I always pick up women's. Um, Kohan brown dress shoes. Kohan men's shoes. So apparently Kohans are selling better for men's. Um, I'm assuming. I don't really know because I'm not looking that up. But so apparently, Cole Haan, you know, men's shoes are being searched more. Um, we do have mules over here, so obviously, uh, Cole Haan mules for women, which is true because I actually did just sell a pair of Cole Haan mules. Um, Price-wise, it wasn't that great. I think I made twenty bucks off of it, which was okay because I paid like I think like a dollar at the bins or something. So, all right, um, yeah. Um, is there any more on this list? Oh, yeah, there's one more, and it is J. Crew, and I'll look that up real quick. And then we're going to have to cut this off, because I have three minutes until this video ends, because I'm using a screen recorder, so it's like a trial type thing, so I have to keep recording and then cutting it off and recording. All right, so J. Crew um, Leopard, J. Crew Leopard, jumpsuits, high-rise, wraps. Um, let's go to top. J. Crew dresses. So yeah, it's not really not a lot going on there. Factory J. Crew. Click that and see what they're saying about that. And it's actually kind of going up right now. Um, <laughs> not much, guys. Not much. So. Type that in. See what we got. Nothing. Oh no. 
right, well, anyway, I hope this video helped you learn a new trick to looking up certain things. Um, you can get keywords from this. You can get um, style names, you know, everything like that. Um, and, you know, you can copy the style name for whatever it is, put it into Google, look it up so you can actually see what it looks like. And if you go to the store and you end up seeing one of those, you're like, oh, yeah, there it is right there. So I... I'm going to end this video now. Um, if you have any questions, just leave a comment below or you can contact me on Instagram at Allie Bethany and I will talk to you all in the next video. Bye.